Engineers inspect the summer video. Here we are. Here, Farscape number three of ten on this building on 205. And this Farscape here has um, a lot of life safety issues. A lot of life safety issues. It's similar to the other one. Looks like this is a problem here on this building. And that is, as you can see right there. The iron rotted right away from the building. So they came in and they put in all these angles, these temporary angles with nothing but expansion bolts. No, no uh, epoxy bolts or no through plates. And all this is on bad brick. So it's really just grabbing onto the veneer of this wall. So there's really nothing here to keep this, this fire escape from pulling away. So that repair there is only holding up that bracket that's holding up this entire staircase. This entire staircase has got nothing but rust, missing bolts. They came in and welded. So instead of you know changing up, putting some new bolts, they just basically came in and welded, but left the rust in every connection. Every connection has huge rust. Huge rust like that. Huge rust. Huge rust. So all these treads are ready to collapse. So life safety issues on this particular fire escape. This is on the rear of 205. And, uh, and when you look at it, water is being fed through cracked sills back into all the connections. So that one's rotted out of the building. That one's rotted out of the building. That one rotted out of the building. That one rotted out of the building. And that one rotted out of the building. So, and this one's pulling out totally out of the building right here and rotted out of the building. So there's been, um, and every single one of these treads, if you look at it, all rotted treads all rotted treads, all rotted treads, both sides. Now that amount of rust, stepping on those, whether you're a tenant or a fireman, is gonna drop those, okay? I see no physical damage to the ladder, so I don't think this ladder's ever been hit by a truck. That ladder there has been hit by a truck and affected the whole fire escape. This one is a straight ladder, so this one just needs to have the ladders um, readjusted. We, kinda, we, we can shift these ladders near the wall so that they can fall closer to the wall and away from trucks that move in the in the alleyway. Um, but we have all original hardware. NFPA code and guidelines require that the fire escape be low tested and or other evidence of strength. This fire escape right now cannot be low tested in the as is condition. It has life safety emergency and it needs 100% of the entire superstructure rebolted because it got rust in every connection. So all original hardware no evidence of maintenance anywhere so this fire escape needs a full refurbishment to avoid the low test if you're going to spot repair it then it's still going to trigger the low test on the remaining bolts and, and rivets that stay behind but 100 percent of all the rust must be removed internally from every connection so every one of these must be swapped out if they're a major connection to uh, the system and uh, the lead on the paint this fire escape does have lead it's older than 1978 see that little trace of orange in the bottom there that's a base of a lead based uh, primers and anything older than 78 has lead on it anyway so must be a licensed renovator any work performed on this fire escape must be done under permits um, and must be done with engineer oversight so an engineer must uh, work with the city official must give him the credentials must give him the criteria for the repair to then low test it or the the criteria to refurbish it to avoid the low test. Any questions? Farscape Engineers Inspector Summary Video. This is Farscape number three of uh, four on building 205 and this Farscape has life safety issues.